We need something that stood out, something interesting for people to interact with. The concept came up pretty naturally. The falling captain standing on a car and jumping on it, it seemed to make sense. The Destiny team, they created this really cool pose. I can stand out there and you stare at this thing and I just can't get enough of it. There's just something about it. So when you, when you stand next to him, he's just kind of focusing on you standing there. The, the detail has to make sense for there to be a sense of functionality to all the things that are part of the character. If you look at the skin texture around the captain's eyes, you will see, you know, little wrinkles. The fallen move in fairly specific ways, and the best way to kind of illustrate that was to show them using the swords, getting the spirit of the color onto the statue. There's so many variables, and to get it just right is, is so hard. Do all these deaths first, because we only have one chance to, to get it right. And if we screw up, that's it. We've been able to carve and create capes that look like they are flowing in the wind. I love that the eyes are going to be glowing, which is kind of a key feature for the Fallen Captain. The game inspires the end result, really. Yeah, I couldn't really be happier. This is great. This is an adventure you're going to be embarking upon when you play Destiny, and these are the kinds of characters you're going to be fighting against. And it's not something that you normally see. I'm very excited for, for it to be out there and for people to enjoy.